happening, Mag the Site. Cosmic Wonder got some more news for us with the leaked footage from Spider-Man No Way Home. And uh, apparently there's uh, some leaked trailer 2 footage or something like that. So let's check this out. How's it going, everybody? It's Warren. Welcome back to the Cosmic Wonder, where we talk all things Marvel and MCU, and of course, Spider-Man. Talking about a lot of Spider-Man since the second trailer should be coming out within the next couple of weeks, and today, and last night, I've been getting a ton of DMs, a ton of ads on Twitter about this supposed leaked footage of the second trailer that has come out. Now, it is actual leaked footage. Yes, I can okay. confirm that. However, it's not quite what you think it is. But I'll explain everything that you need to know about it in this video and give you a trailer to update and talk about some pretty cool Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield news. Also, big thank you to everybody who has told me that it's been cool that I've been putting myself in my videos more. I'm on vacation right now, so I don't have all my setup. But you can follow me on TikTok, and I'll also be back at it when I get back home in about a week. And yes, I'm still doing the Spider-Man action figure giveaway all you got to do to enter subscribe to my channel and then subscribe to my other channel cosmic culture we'll link that down below so i obviously can't show the footage because it's copyrighted and i'll get in trouble with the studios however i think a lot of people have seen it going around on twitter or instagram there's a couple of different that. videos <laughs> out right now and one of them the one i'll talk about is where spider-man gets pain thrown on him now this was originally talked about online by my buddy tyron on twitter then i elaborated on this scene a little bit more when i found out a little bit more details about what is actually happening here spider-man gets green paint thrown on him by a mysterio supporter but what's not in this scene that's going around that comes later on is that spider-man actually flips his suit inside out and that's how we get the gold and black suit I reported this on my website, thecosmicwonder.com, and on my TikTok, <laughs> which is just Cosmic Wonder official. Okay. Yes, I do think the black and gold suit is going to be getting some type of an upgrade in the show. After all, I believe it's called the integrated suit. But I believe that these upgrades are going to come after he turns his suits inside out. I've been told this by three different sources, so I have every reason to believe that it is indeed what is going to happen. <laughs> now, I'm not going to spoil the footage or really anything else for anybody watching this video, but I do need to address what this footage actually is because a lot of people have DM'd me or added me asking me, well, does this mean that the trailer is coming out soon? Because when the first trailer was leaked ahead of time, the real trailer came out the very next day. So since this trailer has been leaked right now, does that mean that we are getting the other trailer today or tomorrow or sometime? No. And I'll explain why. This isn't actual footage from the second trailer. This footage may be included in the second trailer. However, this is footage that was supposed to be in the first teaser trailer that got cut out. It didn't make the final cut for the trailer. However, there is a version of the first uncut trailer going around, which is where these scenes are coming from. But do not be misled. This is not leaked not footage sure. from the second trailer. The second trailer has not been leaked, which means it's probably not coming out today or tomorrow or the next day. Yes, there is new mm -hmm. footage, but huh. it's not really anything that we haven't seen or know about already. There's some Sandman stuff out there, but we all know Sandman is going to be in the film. And yes, it is super exciting. Of course, you all know that I am super excited about it. However, I just don't want people to think that the trailer is going to be dropping within the next couple of days. Hopefully, you guys know that I do my best be nice to keep if it does. up to date with accurate information, and I just do not believe that that second trailer is coming anytime soon. In fact, I do have a little bit of an update for y'all today. Now, I don't work for Sony. I don't know their marketing plan. I don't know all these techniques that they're trying to do for Spider-Man No Way Home. But I do hear things, and now it looks like other people are hearing the same thing that I'm hearing. I heard that the trailer was going to come out next week, but then I heard that that might not actually happen. I was told that it might actually come with Ghostbusters Afterlife. Now, with everything I heard, there was still a possibility that we could get that trailer next week. However, according to viewer Anon, a leaker who has been extremely accurate with everything that they've put out, they say the same thing now. The trailer will most likely come with Ghostbusters Afterlife, which comes out on November 19th. Here is the exact tweet. Okay, seriously, I know you want to see more footage, but the No Way Home teaser broke the 24-hour views record. The film is not out of the public consciousness. You'll get the full trailer around Ghostbusters Afterlife, and the movie will still make a F-ton of money. I also want to say that it would have been cool Fuck if you you'll get your trailer when you fix this dang door. But moving on. The second part of the tweet says, This is not insider knowledge, by the way. Studios mm -hmm. get to attach one trailer to their movies so it plays with every showing. That will almost always be their next release on the calendar. 
Sony's next release after okay. Ghostbusters is Spider-Man. And sadly, this lines up with other things that people have said and things that I've heard. Hopefully it does come a little bit before that, but it looks like we kind of have some waiting to do right now. But this actually gets me thinking about Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield. There have been reports that they are indeed going to be appearing in the second trailer. Now, this causes a lot of conflict between the fandom because some people want to see them, the others don't want to see them until the actual movie. And I completely understand, and I can see both sides. But here is what I think. I think that They'll if they are going to show seats. the other two in a trailer, then they're probably going to wait until the last minute to show that trailer. If you're going to reveal something that big, it's probably going to be right before the movie comes out. Yeah. And if it is going to be attached to Ghostbusters Afterlife, that's November 19th. That's within a month of the actual release in theaters. So perhaps that is actually Sony's plan to show or tease a little bit the other two Spider-Men and do it right before the film. And speaking of that, Sony and Marvel just did something with Toby and Andrew that kind of leads me to believe that it's in prep for the upcoming No Way Home film. Sony is giving Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man trilogy and Andrew Garfield's Spider-Man duology brand new 4K Blu-ray box sets next month. Hmm. hmm. I wonder why they're doing this. Could it be because their <laughs> Spider-Men are about to appear in another movie and they think people are going to want to go out and buy the old original Spider-Man films? I bet that's what it is. Also, they're doing this on November 8th. So that is a day to actually keep your eye on. That is a Monday morning. And although I have not heard anything specifically about November 8th besides the releasing of these new 4K box sets, if they are connected in some way, shape, or form, that could be a trailer date. So right now the dates we're looking at are around November 8th and around November 16th. Now having said this, it doesn't mean that they can't randomly drop the trailer tomorrow. They 100% could, and I really, really hope they do. But typically people do know ahead of time when they are dropping their trailers. I have a few trailer people myself, and so far they've heard nothing, or they've heard that it is coming with Ghostbusters Afterlife. But of course, if I hear anything, I'll be sure to let you all know. But I do think... That it's very, very convenient that the other Spider-Men, Andrew Garfield and Tobey Maguire, their trilogy and duology are getting new box sets. I mean, the timing of it can't really be a coincidence. However, yeah, exactly. it is kind of just me speculating at this point. I'll admit that. But a lot of things are happening. Some scenes are leaking out, despite them being from the old trailers. And I'm not going to show them because people can get fired for these guys. Not trying to get anybody fired. And I actually hope that we don't get any leaked footage from the second trailer because I truly do want to be surprised especially if they are going to show Toby and Andrew in this trailer. I don't want to see that on a crappy video of a video on another person's phone. I want to see that right on my computer screen for the very first time, and I want to get freaked out about it. But let me know what you think about all of this in the comments down below. And what do you think about Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield's Spider-Man movies getting new 4K box sets? Do you think that's coincidence, or do you think that Sony's kind of planning something? Yeah. Here? Let me know what you think in Come the on, comments man. down below. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of the latest no, videos. So. For live updates, you can always follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. And as always, thank you all so much for watching. Woof woof. They show them in the next trailer. So that's going to get more asses in the seats. Even if they didn't show it in the next one, the next trailer, I think they would want to show them at least another trailer before the movie's released because they want to capitalize on selling more Spider-Man DVDs, Toby's trilogy, Andrew Garfield's duology. I mean, that just, it sounds like that's what they're, come on. People do that all the time. You got a new movie in the, and then all of a sudden all these box packages or whatever the next upgrade visually is, you know, you know, 4K and Ultra, you know, all the, I'm telling you, I think that's what's up. And I understand the people talking about, well, I, they don't want to see them in the trailer. I think it could only help this movie. It's not like Batman v Superman, Dawn of Justice, when they released the trailer that showed Doomsday. People were pissed at that. And they found out that people didn't want him in the movie. I spoke to the guy who actually edited that trailer. And he told me he begged them, please do not. 
this is not the trailer you want edited and released. But he was following orders. He, had, he told me he, and when it was released, he was like, told you. People were mad about that. I personally didn't care, but I knew why certain people were. They felt as though, people, you know, too much was added to the film. Maybe I'll ask Mr. Snyder next time I speak to him um, if that was his idea or not to have him in there and to do it that way. If he felt it was too full of a movie already or what, you know, should be an interesting conversation. But nonetheless, uh, interesting. I had no idea that there was leaked footage out for the trailer, but I would prefer to see legit footage. You know what I mean? Because it's usually grainy and not the, you know what I mean? It's, it's just, I'm not that eager to see new footage. Make sure you get over and follow Cosmic Wonder. Smash that new thanks button for me. Also hit the like, the like button, subscribe, and share for me. And I will see y'all later. 10 million subscribers. Woo!